This is so cool. Look at this. Look at this, guys. This is craziness. Wow. I can't believe we've lived here for all these years and we've never seen this. This is absolutely beautiful. Some pretty good ASMR right there. I love that sound of the the babbling river. And there's that tree that we were looking at just a, a little ways back, wishing we could get over here and Lisa found a way. What's going on adventurers? How is everybody doing on this beautiful day? We are out. I'm a little bit concerned. I, I don't have my boots on today and I don't have long pants and this area is very well known for copperheads and eastern diamondback snakes so i'm just going to show you the area we're going to keep going down the road see if we can find an accessible place where we can get to the water because i want lisa to be able to go with me too and enjoy it me personally though the reason why i don't want to go is like i said i know there are venomous snakes in this area we are actually headed into the mountains today we're going to go get something delicious to eat, and then we are going to see where the day takes us. But on our way, there is a, I don't know if this is an accident. Uh, there's a lot of emergency vehicles. I'm not sure what's going on. <laughs> there's a little path right here, um, but there's just not enough of a clearing for me to feel comfortable going in there. So we're going to drive a little bit and see if perhaps we can find a place that is a little bit more easily accessible. So let's go, Lise. All right. Let you guys see the beauty of this. Look at this mountain here. This is like a mountainside. Just amazing. This tree looks like it might have been struck by lightning, Lisa was just saying. But man, it is gorgeous back here. I wonder if this is any more accessible. Sure, is this more accessible? Maybe. All right, so we are out of the car and I'm just gonna show you guys around a little bit. Let's do some exploring. We don't really do that many explore videos because we haven't had a lot of cool places like this to explore. So, we're, is this a dam? Is this like a beaver dam? Guys, this looks like it might be a beaver dam over here. Wow, that is super cool. I don't see any beavers right now. But, I don't know. That's pretty neat. Let's walk down here a little bit. Look how clear this river is too. If I had my water shoes on right now, I probably would get in there. It looks pretty relaxing. That's weird. Is that a coconut? That almost looks like a coconut in the water, but I don't think they have coconuts here. I'm going to uh, zoom in for you. See the thing right there? That's weird. It either looks like a coconut or a turtle shell, but I'm pretty sure it's not either of those. She is ready to go. She's got her walking stick to fight off all the bears. I was just saying, if I, if I had my water shoes, I probably would get in. Wow. I want to see what it feels like. If it feels... Oh, there goes a... Oh, no. I thought it was a fish. It's not a fish. Apparently, it's a, uh, a mosquito. So... It's got a nice little current, though, here. And it would actually be worse, but they have all those rocks up there kind of just slowing it down. I mean, I guess you could really swim in here, couldn't you? I don't know. Oh, maybe we'll see some trout jumping. All right, let's try to let's try to make it over to this island here, guys. I think we can do it. Matter of fact, I know we can. All right, so we're here. We made it to the island. And now with... I just heard something jumping. Maybe that was a trout. Did you see anything? It looked like a river down there. I thought I heard something. Wow, it gets pretty deep right here. It's like... Oh, wow! I just saw something jump, but I, I must have missed it. That's crazy. Did you see anything? Yeah, it's like... It's coming down that... Uh, where that current is. Okay, the deep part. Wow. 
maybe we'll see one in action down here. This is so cool. Look at this. Look at this, guys. This is craziness. Wow. I can't believe we've lived here for all these years and we've never seen this. This is absolutely beautiful. Some pretty good ASMR right there. I love that sound of the, the babbling river. And there's that tree that we were looking at just a, a little ways back, wishing we could get over here and Lisa found a way. Very impressive. Okay, so guys, it looks like the river continues. Would you call this a river? I guess it's a river. A river or a creek. Sometimes they call these a I creek. I think this might be a river, though, because okay. it's pretty yeah. It's pretty wide up there. What was that ripple? Where? And now, see the ripples? Oh, I do see it. Let me see okay. if we can get a little closer. Get a little closer. Um, I don't see anything from here. And it's really weird, too. There's this thing over here that looks like a turtle shell or a coconut. I couldn't figure out what it is. See it? Yeah. It's like right in front of me by that big rock. I have to say, though, um, this is almost as clear as the Wikiwachi River. It's just not blue, but it's very clear. It's different soil. It's the minerals. Yeah, the minerals. It has to do with the minerals, but honestly, like, this is very swimmable. I would probably swim in here. We should come back here and swim. Bring water shoes next time. Yeah, I think we should do that. And bring Maybe. just like some swim shorts, whatever. I would swim in there. Yeah. That would be fun. Would be fun. We could bring our masks, we'll our snorkel mask, and we'll bring our snorkel masks. Oh, yeah. That would be I awesome. Underwater metal detector. Yes. I'll bring my underwater metal detector. If you guys want us to come back and do that, be sure to leave a comment and ask us to come back. Because if you guys want to see it, we'll do it. Now, we're going to go ahead and follow this river down and see where it ends up. Who knows, guys? It could take us someplace really cool. Let's continue on our journey, shall we? Yeah, there are a den here look see it it could be the snake den I'm trying to see you can actually see inside of it all right guys let's go all right so here she goes <sighs> look at these muscles look at them muscles look at them muscles <laughs> she did it We are all about the adventure, guys. We are all about the journey. You know, I think both of them are equally as important. That's why our slogan is, live your adventure, appreciate the journey. A little park. Check it out. Is that a covered bridge? So guys, we just stumbled upon this really cool little park. It's called Roddy Creek. And look at this. I love this. Look at this restroom. How cool is that? Never seen anything like this before. Pretty cool. And it's accessible. I love that too. So we're going to get ready and um, it looks like there's a covered bridge right over this way. We're going to go explore that real quick. Take you guys with us. We could. We could definitely bring Athena. Good stuff right there. Look what Lisa found. I haven't done a swing for 100 years. You can't stop this girl from swinging. I'm a swinger. What's this? You better be careful, you're going to get some offers. Don't tell Jen. Damn! Oh, what the heck? I just kicked my butt, guys. You can't get back a bit. Oh, she got away from me. <laughs> so here's the covered bridge, guys. We're going to get ready and go through in a couple minutes and take you guys with us. But first I just wanted to show you what it looks like from the outside and what it's crossing. This is the same body of water or river that we just went down to a few minutes ago. So, so cool guys. Absolutely beautiful. Like 
something right out of a a painting. It is. This is gorgeous. And look how they somebody had to stack these rocks. Oh yeah, for right, sure. That's definitely man-made, but oh my gosh. But look at the other side there. Look at that. That looks like that's been here for yeah, many, many years. Definitely. I wonder if this is a civil war. Um, it probably is. Because it looks like the split rail fences back past the bridge. Okay, we'll have to drive back there too after we finish walking did. through. Alright. Oh wow, how beautiful over here. Look at this. Absolutely beautiful. So Lisa's gonna run through the bridge now. Really? <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna do the miracle bridge? It's the miracle bridge. It fixes your limp. She limps in and runs out. <laughs> you can do it. I believe in you. Look at her go. I can't keep up with her. <laughs> Watch his cracks. <laughs> yeah, you're definitely going to limp out look, of here if you fall in one of these cracks. Right there, look. You can see right through. Uh, you know, normally I don't do well oh. if I can see below me, like with That's steps and stuff. Scary. I don't know. I'm okay with this for whatever okay. reason. There's something back here. There's some kind of supernatural powers in here. I can oh, feel it. Sure. Oh, is that car trying to get through my bed? Oh my this car's trying to come through right now, oh, guys. Gonna and we're going to get run over and definitely we'll be limping out of here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the miracle. We'll both be limping out of here. Oh, listen to that. Wow. I can't believe that can be on the car. I'm going to look over on this okay, side. Did you see the movie Africa? Yeah. What here, come over here quickly. There's a car coming. At the covered bridge. I don't know. How are we here? Oh, I think you can maybe walk down here. It's not as steep. No? Mm. Not feeling it? I'm not going to risk my leg. Should I go down there and you can wave to me from up okay, here? Okay, we can do that. Can I take the walking stick? I'm, it might be safer in the case of... The royal walking stick? She's, She's allowing it? Alright. Might be bears. Might be snakes. I can handle bears with my bear's hands. <laughs> Alright, be careful. My watch, bear paws. Watch where you're walking. My bear paws. Because it's so... Like Civil War back here. There she goes, guys. I don't know about this. Alright, let's cheer her on because... Real. Jen doesn't like heights and all that, but not really that high. she thinks she can handle this. Oh. <gasps> oh my gosh, did you guys see that? <laughs> I don't think this is helping. <laughs> it's not helping her. Okay. Maybe if you put it on the ground, it'll help. Is this far enough? You can't hold it up in the air. <laughs> I can do this. <laughs> Why isn't this thing helping? <laughs> you might want to touch, touch the surface. Oh. There you go. Okay. Is this? Oh, is this a paw print? This looks like a bear print. It really does. Let me zoom Can in. Hang on. Hang on. I'm not kidding. Really? You see pad marks and then holes in front of it. It just looks like a big pad mark. I don't see anything in front of it. It's just like a. There's a crack. It's like this big. Yeah, it's big. See it? Can you see it? Yeah. Put your stick right next to it. Yeah. It might be. Look back that little path. Maybe they're back. <laughs> what we think we just found is a bear track and Lisa says, why don't you go back there and see if you can find one? <laughs> go ahead, Jen. I'm down. Go ahead. You got the stick. You're good. Okay. She's going in. Might be a baby bear. It's not a baby bear. No? Not a baby bear. Too big for a baby. Probably came down to get a drink. It might be maybe down by the river. I'm getting I need a nice cold drink. I'm definitely gonna have to go on my phone and Google all of the different poison, ivy, oak, sumac, all that stuff. So that I can screenshot it and have a reference because I can never remember what it looks like. Didn't you all graduate Girl Scouts? No, I was a brownie. I never made it. Oh, uh, that's, that's the, the problem. problem. They teach you that in the older group. I did love it though. It was fun. I guess brownies don't learn about poison. I'm going to go back. What, what, do Girl Scouts have like an Eagle Scout thing? Yeah. I don't know. Good question. Maybe we should have Raptor Scouts. Right. There you We're go. We're going to do that. We're going to do the patches. Survival. I, I love that Jeremy's doing that. So I think we're going to do Raptor Scouts. Me or Ernest Dave could maybe be our Scoutmaster. Oh, yeah. He knows all of that. All right. Let me turn around here a little bit. Look how far down I've gotten. Look how far she is. Oh my goodness. It's oh. moving around in that river. Oh, it's like bugs. Oh, a crayfish? Oh, it's dead. Let me zoom in on that one. Can you get it? Yeah, gross. That's 
cool. This is the uh, trail climbing patch. Here. Jen's getting a couple of the beautiful pictures of this. This is actually, I think, called Roddy Creek. I saw a sign. And I believe this is a state park, Maryland State Park area. So we're going to get in the car and travel back this way, guys, in a minute. See what's back here. There's more. These cars come over this bridge. It's so crazy. It goes. Bup, 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 bup. There she comes. Wow, you're making good progress up that hill. How was it down there? See, if I was smart, I would have, I would have came down this way. Yeah, it's a little less. But I'm smart now because I learned that I came back this way. So, <laughs> you know. What did the big tree say to the little tree? I'm not sure. Don't get stumped. So Jen has made it up the hill. All right, guys, here we go. We're going to walk through now. Let's do it. Let's go. You know, sometimes these bridges are haunted. I do know that. Careful. Wait a minute. You're going to cross the threshold. There she goes. <laughs> Jen is going for the ultimate swing challenge. She said she wants to be a swinger too. She's joining the swinger club. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is breaking the rule. That is not how you're supposed to ride a swing. Leave it to Jen. She does everything out of the ordinary. No, what was that? Was, was it really? Are yes. you flying? Because you're like flying. I never thought of that. You I feel like you're flying. Isn't that hurt your stomach? Yeah, because I just ate a whole <laughs> She just ate Mountain Gate. After a few pieces of chicken, One just more time. try that. On my face, Here she goes. Oh! <laughs> Actually, <you're probably laughs> I survived my Superman swing ride, guys, and I still haven't thrown up. <laughs> but there's still time. <laughs> uh, don't throw up in the car. I will not. We do. We are able to wind down the windows now that the tent is finished. So we're good there, but I don't like the throw up. It makes my throat close up. So let's try to avoid that at all costs. Am I the only person that wants to know what this looks like inside? I, I would like to know. Okay. I'm figuring. It's pretty well kept. It actually looks better than some restaurant bathroom. It does. <laughs> if there's nobody in here, which it doesn't look like because the door is ajar. So is it a door or is it ajar? Oh, uh, there might be jar jars in there. Jeremy hey. and George have been here. I would not argue with that. So let's try to do the COVID open. There we go. Ooh, it's nice. Oh, this is one of those ones. Oh, yeah, the earth one. That's what's inside in case anybody was wondering. Gross. It's the earth one. <coughs> is it bad? Oh, no, it looks bad. I can't even go look at it. You have to go look at it. Lisa's going to go look at some poopy. Oh. She's going to go look at some turds. Wait, I dare you to stick your hand in there. No. No, I'm not going to. You might get COVID if you do. I was going to pee, but never mind. Maybe not. The side of the road is looking better than that? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I got to give them credit, though. The outside of this building is absolutely really cool. It actually really doesn't really smell cool. as much as you think. No, but it's, it's like a psychological thing. It's psychological. Yeah, it is psychological. It make, like you it's see poopy, you see poopy and you all of a sudden start smelling it. Yeah. Whether you can smell it or not. I was gagging right there. That made me gag more than the swing. It was like the combination was deadly. <laughs> okay, which was worse, that or the Crystal River bathroom? Oh, the Crystal River bathroom was worse. It, it was just really dirty in there. Okay. So yeah. This was clean. This was clean. It just looks disgusting because of the poop down flushable. there. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. I'm glad we got that clear. Got that clear. <laughs> we have to rate them. Okay, guys. So we're getting ready to drive through the bridge that we just took you through. Let you have that experience also. Here we go. I don't know if we're going to fit under. Oh, no. All right, here we go, guys. We're going. I think so. I think we'll just make it. I think so. Going in. Oh. 
Uh oh, it sounds like it's gonna fall apart. That was creaking. If you look over here though, they do have the Civil War era bridges. I mean fencing. What's this thing? Oh, private property. Oh. Um, it is private property. Look at this. This must be a spring house here. That's really cool. That looks like a spring house, right? Yeah, it's definitely. This is an old, old house. Matter of fact, it has a bell on top. It might have been a schoolhouse at one point. Interesting. Yeah, I believe so. Oh no, I don't know if we'll make it, guys. I have to say, I'm really enjoying this type of video. The whole exploration thing. Like I said, we haven't gotten to do a whole lot of those. Um, just going out and exploring. But I do enjoy it. So let us know if you guys enjoy these kind of videos because we certainly enjoy making all the videos that we make. So, um, you know, it's, it's the best of both worlds. You get to explore and you get to travel. And, you know, we do love visiting animals and stuff like that. But you never know what you might come across while you're exploring. You could come across an animal. So that would be awesome as well. Right now we're just turning around illegally in somebody's driveway. Bet, um, Don't mind us. I bet there's foxes out in the field. I bet there's foxes and deer and... Deer. Uh, yeah, deer. Obviously there are bears back here somewhere, guys. Obviously. Because I saw that paw print. So we just sat down to eat here at Texas Roadhouse. And this was the first silverware that I opened up. So I decided since they had an extra one, no biggie. At least they handed me this one. And surprise! This one's just as dirty, if not worse, than the first one. Gross! Michelle just opened up hers, and hers has a little surprise on it, too. What do you suppose that is, Michelle? Shoot, I don't know. It looks like a piece of napkin stuck to a piece of food. <laughs> How's yours? How's it? This is my brother and my dad. And Eddie's my brother. That's Michelle, his girlfriend. This is Lisa. You guys might recognize her. Nah. She's been in a couple videos. <laughs> you can lead a Doberman to water, but you can't make it lay down. Come on. So apparently she thinks it's her water bowl now. <laughs> Good girl, Thin. Look, she's buttholing the pool. This is what she does to her leg. She buttholes us. And she's doing it to her new pool right now. Good girl. Isn't that better? Now that my leg's all fucking wet. Thank you for that. Look what you did. Nice and cool. Look what you did. Now, Look oh. what you've done. You've gotten them all wet now. All right. And shake, 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 shake. <laughs> Yeah, get back in there. Come on. Good girl. Yay. You have your very own pool now. Lay down. What's happening? I smelled something. What do you smell? Something. What is it, girl? What is it? <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs> Here comes the poop patrol. Poop patrol. Tina has left us some landmines. Ugh, God. Ew. Gross. Lisa, I think you might have missed a spot. I did miss a spot. Oh, she got two. Oh, wow. Two for one. She's going to, she had to, she had to get up for this one. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a drive-by. No drive-by. That's not a drive-by scooping right there. <laughs> there goes Farmer Eddie. He's skirting out on the John Deere. <laughs> <laughs> 